guys. Just sum that up, pretty dreadful evening. Yeah, it weren't great. Um, I think obviously bad first half. Um, Make second half, Carl Bartley, a few mistakes, individual errors. I think that's an understatement to be honest. I feel like that's the worst individual performance I've seen in absolutely ages from Carl Bartley. We were poor today, it's probably the worst I've seen us this season at the Hawthorns. Got to give ourselves a sniff at the end with the Santé again. He's earned himself a start, I think, next time. But Carl Bartley, I don't like booing players, but I think he absolutely deserved every boo he got out there for me. Um, very good Tyler. Super, don't know what he's doing. He needs to go out on the team. Uh, he didn't try to find my sir. All that day. Super, I miss that. Therefore, but we'll see a new player came in. Peter. Yeah, that's like the worst I've seen seen them play so far this season. And it, what makes it worse is that it was a local derby. You know, any other team other than Birmingham City in this league, maybe even Coventry as well, and it wouldn't be so bad. You know, we could pick up and go again. But being a derby day, you know, we can't be putting performances like that. It was. It was an awful start, which we seem to be doing a lot recently. Um, got back in at one all. Then I thought we picked up a bit. Then the uh, first half petered out and. Second half, as so I just thought it was messy, scrappy, and very, very disappointing. What, what do you think the problem is? Do you think it's just individual errors at the moment that are costing us? I think so. I think like I think we've been playing well up until today. I wouldn't say we've been playing uh, badly. I think we played poorly today. But for me, it was individual errors cost us. I think Button maybe could have done better with a couple of those. I didn't see, like watching the replay. We'll need to see that. It's on the counter, um, took the chance as well. It feels like the same goals every week. We go one 0 down. If someone break, breaks, scores against Kane. But... Yeah, and if for my start, don't fit, uh, fit our team perfect. I think our play's becoming a bit predictable now. It's always down the side, comes across, no one's there to meet the cross because we haven't got anyone to meet it. Um, but yeah, you know, errors as well. I think it's a combination of things, to be honest. Um, but tonight, you know, scoring the goals weren't the issue, it's keeping them out. And just finally, that's one win in nine now. Do you think Bruce is under a little bit of pressure? <laughs> yeah, absolutely, I think. Yeah, I think he might get one more game, he might get the weekend, but for me, that, yeah, he's, he's, he's teaming on the edge of it. Depends if they got the way to sack him as well. Though, yeah, so I think with that, a poor performance on the weekend could see the end of Bruce for me. I told you he'd do that. Did he want more? He, if we don't win that shot, he needs need to go. Yeah, I believe he's under pressure. Um, I mean, the transfer window really hasn't helped him, especially deadline day, the fiasco there. Um, got a couple of free agents in, okay, Eric Peters did feature today, but, you know, it was too little too late, it was after their third goal and we were 3-1 down. We worried them a little bit by scoring the penalty with Thomas Asante, decent goal from him. Jed Wallace was okay in parts, especially when he scored our first goal, but for, the, for most of the team, I mean, my personal opinion, you start Carl Bartley and you're on the back foot straight from the off. And that's my opinion, that's not the opinion of any other Albion fan, but as soon as Carl Bartley was starting, I was worried because he just he just doesn't have the legs anymore. The thing is, I mean, I'll say he is, but we can't afford a sack him if we wanted to, because there's apparently no money. But whoever, who's going to come in, really, with no money? Who's going to come to this club? You know, the owner is killing us. I think if you lose against Norris, I think he would be going. Maybe now I should wait if they stump up the money, but I really don't know. But it's, um, it's not looking hopeful at the moment, unfortunately. But.